As News 13's Hannah McKenzie reports, he didn't just lose his wheels. He lost a chance at an international championship title. Pieces of foam from inside Dustin Baker's hand cycle are still out here at Lower Brush Creek Road. Finishing up a training run, he was less than a mile from his house when he was hit. Dustin Baker doesn't take life lying down unless he's riding his hand cycle. Paralyzed from a spinal cord injury sustained overseas, he turned to racing as a way to escape. That's your little bit of reprieve. That's your chance to get out, not be clouded with all those different things going through your head and just kind of recharge a little. The U.S. Air Force veteran, no stranger to overcoming challenges. I always look at, even even I've been looking at this one, is okay, what's, what's the silver lining? Baker's silver lining leading to gold. He's competed across the country, excelling at the sport. After securing a spot in the Paracycling Road World Cup Championships in Canada this August, Baker was training Tuesday when his first place medal dreams were dashed. Someone in a truck hit him. So with the hand cycle, we lay out flat, so uh, impact was directly on my head and my shoulder. I uh, ended up with uh, three broken ribs. I've got a, a damaged uh, rotator cuff. Uh, lacerations, the face, concussion, and then I've got road rash over half, half the, the back and lacerations on the chest. Baker's $35,000 hand cycle destroyed. There's nothing repairable from this, unfortunately. His wife Jody showing us the damage, grateful it wasn't worse. That could have been him. This could be him laying here in pieces. But you can't keep this 41-year-old down. His sights already set on rehabbing his shoulder for the next race. He'll be back on the road soon with a word of caution for motorists. Be patient. Be aware. Um, you know, don't, don't, obviously, don't be on the phones. It's really easy to miss an you know, upright bike or a hand cyclist. And, uh, just support us in our effort. The Bakers had a GoFundMe account to raise money for the upcoming championship. That page now more of an effort to get Dustin a new hand cycle. We've got a link on our website, WLOS.com. Hannah McKenzie, News 13.